Hello, my name is Donna, the Governor of District 1, which includes Nova Scotia, Canada, and the New England states in the United States. We're in the season of autumn here now. The air is getting cooler and the leaves are changing colors. Like the trees that so proudly display their different colors, Zanchins are unique, diverse individuals from many different countries and cultures all standing together. Our seasonal changes have been predictable, but climate change is not and is creating a worldwide crisis. The impact on women is great. I joined Zanta because I believe together we can do more than we can alone. Zanta says no to all violence against women and Zanta says now to take action on climate change. Please join our team of young and seasoned professionals to engage in networking opportunities and build a better world for women and girls. Hi, I'm Liz. I am Zanta District 2 Governor, located in upstate New York and part of Canada. Welcome to the foothills of the Adirondack Mountains. Fall is a beautiful time of year here. The leaves are changing and there's a nice chill to the air. Some of the leaves are even changing orange. And orange always reminds me of the Zanta Says No campaign, where we orange the world for 16 days starting November 25th, where we advocate for women and girls against gender-based violence. We recognize that women's rights are human rights, and together we can build a better world for women and girls. Hi, I'm Lisa. I'm the governor for District 3. I am so proud to be able to say that I am leading a dedicated group of men and women who are committed to the Zanta spirit of advocacy and service. District 3 covers New York, New Jersey, Pennsylvania, Maryland, Virginia, and the District of Columbia. We have a legacy of outstanding service. We have clubs that just started with us this year, and we have clubs that have turned 100 years old. We invite you all to join us as we pursue the Zanta mission of building a better world for women and girls. everyone, my name is Sheena, and I'm the District 4 Governor, which is also known as a District of First. My district encompasses Central Ontario, Canada, where I'm from, and the western states of New York and Pennsylvania in the United States. This handsome dude next to me is my giant schnauzer and pro-baby Eli, and this is where I hang out and do most of my Zanta work during the summer. I love being outdoors and active, and this guy and my partner helped me make, do that. I came to Zanta to be inspired by professional women, but realized that many were unaware of the violence against women in their own community. Having advocated for women in my workplace, I soon found my passion in Zanta to bring awareness about issues facing women. The Zanta Says No campaign has helped all of us become more aware of gender-based violence, both locally and globally. I am so inspired by all the Zanta members around me, and I know together, we will build a better world for women and girls. Hi, I am Deb Lau, Governor of Zant International, District 8. District 8 includes the states of Washington, Oregon, Idaho, Alaska, and British Columbia, Canada. I am talking to you today from my home on Anderson Island in the South Puget Sound in the state of Washington. Please join me and say no to violence against women. Please join me to stop child marriages, not only worldwide, but right here in the United States. Please join me and help educate women and girls. Please join me to obtain gender equality for all. Please join me and join Zonta. Thank you. Hi, I'm Connie, and I'm honored to serve as governor of District 10, comprised of the states of Oklahoma, Arkansas, Louisiana, and Texas for 2022-2024. I'm joining you today from my home in Choctaw, Oklahoma, where I enjoy reading, watching football, and having family over to swim. 
I'm passionate about Zonta's stance that women's rights are synonymous with human rights and women should have an equal footing with men. I feel gender equality is really about mutual respect for each and every person. No woman should live in fear of violence. This is why I love the Zonta Says No to Violence Against Women campaign during the 16 days of activism and the awareness it brings to the gender-based violence issue. Promoting mutual respect can help end gender-based violence and is a key step to build a better world for women and girls. Hello all, I'm Burn Hatla, Governor of District 13 for this BNU 22-24. I became a Sunshine in 1991, and I have always had passion for Santa's mission and mission, for women's rights, and always said yes if I was asked to do something for Santa. I like nature, voyages, family life, and being with friends. As we all know, instances of gender-based violence in the world have risen throughout the COVID pandemic. Therefore, I ask everyone to take a time to think about what action you, yourself, can take right now to make this situation better. How can we, as an individual and a group, bring awareness to this issue and advocate on behalf of gender-based violence survivors? So please, all districts, areas, and Santa groups, take part in the 16 days of activism to end gender-based violence from the 25th to November to the 10th of December. Remember, Santa says no to violence against women. Now more than ever, it is essential that we work together to end violence against women and girls, build a better world for women and girls. Hi, it's me, Heike. I'm part of the Great Santa World and I'm the District Governor of District 14. Welcome to my beautiful, super tiny, cozy and beautiful hometown Bad Gleichenberg. In my community, I deeply care for the people. Here I witness gender-based poverty every day, especially among the elderly. These and several other social issues drive me to run for Santa. Why Santa? Because we believe in making the world a better place by empowering women. I find joy I, in doing this in a supportive community of like-minded professionals from all around the world. As the 16 days of activism, starting by 25th of November, I invite you to join us. Santa says no to violence against women child marriage and human trafficking, and many other things. We will not rest until women's rights are recognized as human rights. Together we can do it. Together we can build a better world for women and girls. Hi, I'm Philippa and I'm the Governor of District 16, New Zealand. I've been in Zonta since 2007 and I have true passion of making a difference in this world. But on my own, I can't do that. And that's why I'm in an organisation that help people locally, nationally and internationally. I love the fact that on a club level, we can help those in our own communities. and a district level, we can help people in our country. And internationally, we have fabulous projects all around the world. We have a 16 days of activism in November, December each year, where we say no to violence against women. And that is a true passion of mine. Thank you. And let's make this world a better world for women and girls. Hola, soy Magdalena. Una alegría y un honor para mí poder representar a Sonta Internacional en la región Sudamérica por el bienio 2022-2024. Los derechos de las mujeres son derechos humanos en nuestra región y en nuestro país Uruguay. Otro pilar fundamental para poder desarrollarse plenamente la mujer es la educación. Solamente entre todos que debemos cuidar esos derechos. Solamente todos juntos 
podemos construir un mundo mejor para mujeres y niñas. Hello, I'm Lynn, the District Governor for District 22, uh, which is based mostly in Queensland, Australia, but we also have the Northern Rivers of New South Wales. Um, I'm, this is in my home area of Springfield Lakes, which is in southeast Queensland. Um, and as I really like the native bushland and the birds, then that's why you have this as my background. In terms of thinking about Zonta Says No, violence against women and girls is one of the most widespread, persistent and devastating human rights in our world today and is a threat to millions of girls and women both online and offline. It affects women regardless of their age, their background or even their level of education. In Australia, violence against women is called many different things, including domestic violence, family violence, intimate partner violence, coercive control, workplace sexual harassment, street harassment and sexual assault. Our statistics are appalling. On average, one woman a week is murdered by her current or former partner. One in five women has experienced sexual assault since the age of 15. Almost 10 women a day are hospitalised for assault injuries perpetrated by a spouse or domestic partner. And women with disabilities in Australia are around two times more likely than women without disabilities to have experienced sexual violence and intimate partner violence. Our young women are also subject to significantly higher rates of physical and sexual violence than women in an older age group. Our, thankfully, our 44 Zonta clubs across Queensland and Northern Rivers of New South Wales will be joining the Zonta Says No campaign and the 16 days of activ activism wholeheartedly. And we trust that our activities will demonstrate ways in which safe, secure and healthy lives for women and girls are ensured and which will build a better world for women and girls. Hi, I'm Jean, Governor of District 24, which encompasses New South Wales and Australian Capital Territory in Australia. Here I am in my garden in my home in the small village of Lagan in southern New South Wales. District 24 is committed to raising our voices to bringing awareness of violence against women and gender inequality through 16 days of activism. Build a better world for women and girls. Namaste. I'm Sri Jana, Governor of Zonta International District 25. I'm a tourism entrepreneur since the past 30 years. Um, I love gardening, traveling, and I'm passionate about helping, uplifting, less fortunate women and girls. As a Zonchan, I feel really happy that we are all together in this. Nepal is a beautiful country with rich natural resources, amazing landscape and people. It is the home to the world, world's highest uh, mountain, Mount Everest, and has eight of the world's 14 tallest peaks. Nepal has been implementing a zero tolerance policy on gender-based violence and embracing the idea of mainstreaming gender equality and social inclusion into climate change mitigation and adaptation program. However, much work needs to be done. Hence, I urge all of you to join Zonta Says No to Gender-Based Violence and Zonta Says Now to Gender Equality and Climate Action. Campaign to do your bit as a global citizen to build a better world for women and girls. I'm walking in the rain. I'm Ute, the governor of District 27 in the northeastern part of Germany. I like it very much to live in the countryside. I like jogging in the early morning and playing tennis when time allows. A ball is a very good medium to get in touch with others and make connections. At Zonta, we also try to build connections. We advocate for gender equity and for our vision to aim for a world in which women's rights are recognized as human rights to come true. As a result, advocacy and action have moved to the forefront of much of what we do. That means for our district to take on advocacy initiatives. 
My goal is that 100% of the clubs in District 27 participate in an action to combat gender-based violence, which may include taking part in the Orange the World effort over the 16 days of activism, beginning on November 25th and ending on December 10th. And now, ladies, Santa to surf. Build a better world for women and girls. Making our world a little better for women and girls. That's what I want to achieve in a strong community. That's why I am with Santa. I am Christine, District 28 Governor. I live and work in beautiful Marburg, a university town with about 80,000 inhabitants, 100 km north from Frankfurt, Germany. 16 days of activism and Santa says no are actions in which we can get involved together. Too many women still experience violence. They need our solidarity. Unfortunately, we have to keep attention to the fact that domestic and sexual violence is not decreasing worldwide. On November 25, we shout out together again. Violence against women and girls is a no-go. Join us. Set a sign. Only together we are strong. Build a better world for women and girls. Hi, I am Christine. It's a great honor to serve Zonta International as governor of District 29, 2022 to 24. I am living in the middle west of France, along the Atlantic coast, as you can see. Zonta International is a gateway to the world. I love learning from others and sharing the same values and goals as all my Zontian friends in the world. I have a dream. It is a world without violence against women and girls. During the 16 days of activism between the 25th of November to the 10th of December, all Zontian's voices around the world are rising to say no. No to violence against women and girls. No to sexism. No to machismo. No to child marriage. No to female mutilation. And all Zontian voices around the world are rising to say yes. Yes to the right of education everywhere in the world. Yes to the right of equality between women and men and yes to the right of legal abortion everywhere in the world. A yes to be free to say no. We need everyone to build a better world for women and girls. Hi, I'm Ivana and I'm honored to be the governor of this attorney. I'm Italian and I live in Piedmont, in the Lange region. This is what I want to say to you today. Violence against women and girls is one of the most common human rights violations and a global epidemic. It has no passport, no cultural barriers. Violence takes place at home, in their workplace and in open spaces, everywhere. Zond International works towards a world free of violence through prevention and educational programs. It's time to act now. We must fight violence in all forms in order to build a better world for women and girls. Hi, I'm Una, and I am honored to serve as a governor of Jonta International District 32, Korea. I enjoy taking a walk with my fellow Jonchans in this beautiful area of Wukundang where I live. Jonta stands for women's right, and we believe in making a better world by empowering women 
through the ex expanding the educational opportunities and service project. We District 32 is planning to have a campaign district wide for Junta says no to any kind of violence against women and girls during 16 days of activism. We will do it in the central part of the capital city of Seoul and all Junchons throughout the country will join in orange t-shirts. We have joy and pride in living Junta spirit and doing things together for making a better world for women and girls.